First of all, shout out to Paddy. Thanks for sending me the book, man. I am going to get into this ASAP. Um, yeah, interesting. I remember, I remember him being bumped to the main event in Dublin. Yeah, and I think he opened the card as well when McGregor fought Brandao. Mm, yeah, that was the one. That was the loudest event I've ever been to. That was insane. And uh, I think I think he was the first one to go out there in the night, so he kind of set the tone for all of it. So I like him. I yeah. Like how he fights. Yeah, he's good. He's yeah. getting into politics now as well, isn't he? Is he? Yeah, yeah. You wouldn't fucking mess with him, would you? Yeah. Nah. No. You know when you read it, can you read it out loud and record it so I can listen to it? Because I don't like reading it. <laughs> I want to know what happens, but I'm not a if big If there's reader. an audio book with him recording, re- re- with his voice recording oh, it, I'm dude. definitely listening to that. Yeah, for real. Because it was like, we, we did a day of filming w- um, with, uh, what was it, before M- uh, McGregor fought, was it Mayweather? It might have been. Anyway, we were over there and we went to Crumlin Boxing Club and checked out a few places and it was it was Paddy and I and we were we were at his gym to start with. And he's got a cool setup, really, really cool. He's got a painting on the wall, one of his students did. And it's the uh, it, it's basically the um, the Pink Floyd Dark Side of the Moon logo. Oh, shit. But uh, white comes into one side and then all the belts of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu come out the other. Oh, nice. It's brilliant. It's nice. nice. It's painted on the wall of his gym. Um, yeah, but he's, uh, he's a fascinating dude. We had a, we had a lot of fun talking that day. I'm going to get into that. Thank you for Paddy. Thank you.